Okay, here we go. Okay, um, with tempo, should I decrease? Yes. The answer is always yes. If you're struggling with the tempo and if you're struggling to hit your repetition range, or if you are at the bottom of your repetition rep range uh, or your rep range and you're struggling with tempo, the answer is always master the tempo on that load. If you have to decrease the load, decrease the load, but tempo, tempo, tempo is always the focus. Remember, technique, sport, be, the, the importance is technique being super important because we don't want to hurt ourselves. Tempo to assess how much load we should be moving. And then lastly is where we focus on the load, all right? So, sorry, um, oh my God, technique, technique, tempo, time under tension, the tempo, the repetition range should be telling you as well what load to move. And the load that you move also depends on how you're feeling on the day. That is how you should be looking at it. How to know how much load to put, technique on point, Understand the tempo that I'm asking you to follow, even if that means that we can only do it with one pound or two. No ego lifting in here. Repetition ranges should be telling you if it's higher load, lower load, and the load changes, most likely depending on how you're feeling on the day. It remains very close, but some days we can lift heavier, some days we cannot. So that is the, the order of importance. Uh, let's just continue with this.